right, here's part of the whole process we saw last. Oh, he loves Maggie. This is part of the whole process we saw last time. Everybody has to get used to each other. This is who he's going to be raised with. This is who he's going to protect. And he's liable to get head butted. He's liable to get stomped at by some of the older females. But this is all part of the process. He gets used to everybody, they get used to him. That's why in this type of situation, a few people have said, well, can't you do a rescue dog? Rescue dogs are great for pets or certain things, but if they've not been raised with these animals, and that's very important, they'd be raised, that's their training and grow up with them and therefore bond with them and become their protector. There's the stomp. What are we doing, buddy? You're getting used to everybody. You're getting used to everybody. Now see, here's where it can get rough. She's protecting. She's she is protecting, protecting that yeah. baby. He puts his little head in you. <laughs> Look what we've got. Aww. Now we miss our Moses. And just to clear a few things up, Moses didn't die of old age. He had a bowel obstruction and he died during surgery. So that was rough. Yeah. So anytime you get a pet, you understand that they're not going to be with us forever. Right. But boy, I tell you what, look at that little <laughs> face. How sweet. Look at that little face. Maggie absolutely loves him. The sheep, you know, they're going to stomp a little bit and they're going to carry on, but it's very important for him to be welcomed into the flock per se because he will be huge someday and he will be our guardian. Look how precious. He is precious. So, so far so good. The really interesting thing about this whole thing is this little dog came from the same farm in Western Kentucky, Four Harper Farm, and he looks so much like Moses. This little, this, this little pink spot on his nose right here, Moses had the exact same thing. So we're driving back, we're thinking about names. Right. Kelly says, well, how about Moses Jr? A mojo. I'm like, hey. you liked it instantly. Now, when I was a kid, all the old timers, not all the old timers, but some of the guys that I knew that had bird dogs and, and squirrel dogs and so on and so forth, they would have one fellow I knew, Dexter Wilburn, he would have Jake okay. and Julie. And when he lost a dog, he'd have Jake and Julie. And Julie. <laughs> So I see no harm. He's going to have his own personality, yeah. but I see no harm in, in carrying on the same name, same farm, same deal. It's a little different, Mojo. And he's a little different, and he might have a whole different personality. It's yeah. so interesting to watch him. But we're going to have a lot of fun. Yeah. You're going to see him raised up with everybody around here. So that's Mo. Mo. Mojo. Mojo. I like Moses. that. Moses. <laughs> he's going to be called a lot of things.